If you're looking to boost your Mutt team or make some money by selling coins, check out MobileMaddenCoins.com. Use code CLICKWID at checkout for a 10% discount. Hey, what is going on guys? Clickwood here back again with another Madden video and guys today what you're going to be taking a look at is a little bit of Madden 17 footage. Now this is coming from iMaverick's channel. I will leave a link to the video in the description below. He talks a little bit more about the aggressive catching here uh, that you're seeing on your screen. He did a lot of testing with it and you're seeing there a lot of new animations for Madden 17. Big, big improvements from what they did this year in Madden 16, although right there, you can obviously see that the receiver can still go up and sometimes make some crazy plays. Uh, so that's the quick clips from Madden 17, but I want to talk a little bit more about it because I actually think that EA has done a really great job so far uh, as far as like addressing some of the major issues that we have going into Madden 17 from Madden 16, Madden 15, and Madden 25. The past three years, I feel like since we've gone to the next generation consoles we've a lot of times seen some of these animations and these specific types of things like this like the aggressive catch specifically that have really caused a lot of problems in Madden because basically if you see single coverage almost regardless of what corner that you're looking at and almost regardless of what receiver you're throwing to it's usually a wise decision to try and throw it up into coverage and make the play on the aggressive catch and you're going to see me do it a couple times in this video here this is from Madden 16 a draft champion game gameplay isn't really that appropriate for the content but you know whatever We're, it's just something to watch anyway well i'm bs in here so uh anyway though guys as you get that user pick son uh <laughs> anyway though uh the aggressive catching though has been a huge problem in madden 16 and it's great to see them kind of addressing it here in madden 17 now unfortunately i haven't had a chance to actually play this game yet so I haven't done any of my own research, but from what I've read and from what I've heard from countless, countless people at this point who have tried it, it's a lot better. I mean, we're talking about major, major improvements here. Now, one thing that I am a little bit worried about is that I don't want it to be where all you have to do is press one button, say, you know, the A button or the X button on uh, PlayStation and the A button on the Xbox One. I don't want that to be the situation. I want it to be that you do have to actually, you know, make some plays with your user somehow and time it correctly and things like that. But I mean, even still, I do like to see the fact that they've put in some of these nice animations because they're a hell of a lot more realistic than they are this year where the receiver base or the cornerback basically jumps up and either goes for an interception with both hands or else he stands there like an idiot or, you know, occasionally you can press the play receiver button and you'll try and tackle him. But that doesn't really seem to work all that often either, especially at this point when everybody's got 103 catching traffic and stuff like that. So, uh, you know, like I said, having those animations where the guy jumps up and actually hits the ball while it gets to the receiver is nice. Now, I wish that it, it, it kind of almost looks like that the cornerback waits till the receiver has his hands on the ball and then he jumps up and swats it away versus maybe getting there before the ball. I would like to see some of that included. Maybe it is, maybe it isn't. I don't know. I haven't seen it yet in any of the gameplay footage, but I want to hear what you guys have to say. I mean, are you excited for these gameplay improvements? Do you think that what you've seen in some of these other videos, like the aggressive catch stopping, do you think these are major improvements or am I crazy? I don't know. Let me know in the comments section below, though, guys. I'm personally excited for it. Really looking forward to Madden 17 because the gameplay in Madden 16, despite the fact that I'm going to get the W in this game, it just kind of killed me, to be honest with you. Like, it really just kind of breaks my heart to play it sometimes. So, thanks again, guys. Hope you enjoyed the video. If you did, do me a favor. Drop the like on it. Subscribe to the channel if you're new. And I will talk to you guys again soon.